June 15th and we're starting a little project in the backyard. The Grand Till is tearing out the old railroad ties. We're going to start building a little deck behind the computer room and add a study and uh, sort of a plant room, I guess, behind our bedroom. Been our builder this year, past year, and his son. Taking out the lilac and the snowball tree and the sod. Starting to dig the foundation. I don't know what's going on. What's going to happen here? <laughs> well, the rain spout's been knocked down. Pipe's broken from our new sprinkling system. It's really wrecked a mess here. Lost one of the maple trees. It was so pretty last fall. The hill is cut in half. And we'll soon have a deck atop it. There's a bouquet of our peace roses that we just picked this evening. I don't think we've ever had quite such lovely big blossoms on that plant. Kind of fun to be back with our rose garden and be able to pick lovely flowers in your garden, bring them in the home. Here's our patriotic bouquet. And here's the Forever rose that the gardeners gave me. A real rose dipped in, in gold. Hey Ben, I think he's got the knack of it. Or Joe, who was it helped Nate? Looks like he's learning how. You learned how to use that. I've never heard of them. Grandpa, when's our next fire set? We need to bring a young one. Well, we thought we would do it kind of towards the end of the summer. Wait, how old? I'm not old enough. Not yet. How old is it? It won't be too long. Yeah. Ten years old. Yeah, with that. He's He's going to turn to Next Paul. Paul. He's coming up next Monday. He's coming up. Uh, we'll be here. Uh, Meryl and Sarah. Start him. 
Well, that's November. Right? Is your vibrator on? Uh, uh, well, Brent, yeah, Bill, you can't. Not, no. Not, no. Not Wednesday. Do you want to eat That'd be a good one to do with all. Maybe Kendra's going to end up with short and hair. And that's one reason why you let mommy and daddy comb your hair. Little baby. Huh? That's Stop. why we always have mommy and daddy comb your hair. It's the baby's nose. Too hard for little girls. The baby, oh. <laughs> you can do it, Kendra, just with a different brush. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hey, let's not use these. Okay? Well, here's the ongoing progress of the addition to the house. Taking the brick off the back wall of our bedroom. Yards later, the bricks are all off. There they are. Well, they're working on the second story framing. The grand's here with all his kids helping today. It's they're all out of school. Uh huh. Well, there's a big chunk of the roof gone now. Over here, we're going to have a deck one of these days. July 15th, the rooms are progressing. They've got the sideboard up and the trusses are supposed to come today. Well, they've got the start on the deck. Today's the uh, 19th of July, and there's the Grand and his kids have 
got the trusses up. Trying to get the roof connected before the rain comes again. Well, today they're carrying the big pieces of board up to the roof to close in the roof of the new section. The grandson is a real worker. They're lifting up the big boards onto the roof and he's taking them over to where they're building the new roof. Boys are really good to develop muscles in their work. Isn't that something? He's going to figure out how to get that over there all by himself. My Look at that. He just rolls it over and over. Isn't that amazing? They're sure learning to work. Now he's going to turn it to get it to go in the right direction. board <laughs> and he's going to hoist it up the ladder to his dad. goes across the roof. The next one ready. Here's the view from our bedroom window that will soon be made much smaller, looking into the area that will be the new study. We'll still get a bit of an outdoor look. Unlock the treetops. It's progressing well. Hopefully, we'll be able to resurrect the lawn. 
It's surely taken a beating. Another view of the study from the outside. This brick will be covered by the siding eventually. It is now October 20th. There's a lot of time has gone by since I've updated. Not a lot of work has been done on the deck, but there it is. We have decided to enlarge it a great deal and go clear out uh, into here and here and over to the fence. It's going to be a big project. I hope we can get it done before winter sets in. The tree has been beautiful this fall. The maple tree, we hope that it survives and provides nice shade for the deck. This is an inside view of Dad's new study. Ready to get everything moved in. He's got his treadmill already there. These lovely cherry wood, natural cherry wood bookshelves to be filled and light fixtures at the various on the uh, south end, we have the cabinets built under the window. So the cherry wood and moved up the desk from downstairs. I'm sure there will be other additions and changes but for now. That there's the outside view of the new wing. Uh, the brand's working down to finish up the plant room downstairs. We'll have to take an interior view of that later. It's Grand's truck. Oh, oh, oh. oh good. Do the ring okay, of Rosie again. Ring Rosie. Once more. Do it again, man. Okay. Well, you don't have to if you don't want it. This is our October <laughs> birthday party, <laughs> just winding up. 1999, the last October birthday party of the century. Oh, I got to go and get the cake, right? I think you should charge of it. Let's have a, let's sing a little bit more while we're waiting. Okay. Oh. Well, let's see. We let Brayden choose a song. How about you? Uh, Me too. Yeah, okay, Sarah. What song? I want to see the temple. Okay. Hey, you can do it. Ready? You don't know how? Maybe your mom can read it. Kendra, you know that one? I want to see the temple. I'd love to see the temple. I'd love to see the temple. I'm going there someday to the Holy Spirit to listen and to pray. Oh, the temple is the house of God. Sarah chose one. Kendra's uh, turn. Kendra, do you want to choose a song? What song? What song? song? Kendra? Song. You decide which one. You said. Cool. What's your favorite song? Was it Sarah? Yeah, you remember? Can I do Gracias Malo? Oh, I okay. like that one. <laughs> Ready? You sing, I can okay. Really pass okay, ready? Okay. All over the world at the end of day, heaven 
Heavenly Father's children kneel down and pray. We sing thank you in his own special way. Saying thank you, thank you in his own special way. Gracias, malo, vir, Duncan, dear. All over the world, tender voices hear. Some say talk, others mercy. Oh, come, we thank thee. Our heavenly Father hears them. He understands each time. Loves them, loves them, everyone. Turn out the lights! Yeah. Out! Turn that light out! Hey! Okay. Wow. I can't walk the candle. All the birthday people. Find their candle. Find their oh, name. Oh, wow. Mom, you're just right here. <laughs> well, I'll let you blow it up. Yeah, I get to blow out all of them. No, no, you never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna make a big blow and blow out all of those. Yeah, if anyone has sore throat, Ready, blow, please. Set, go. Yeah, Joe. Happy birthday to you. 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 Ready, go. <gasps> Huge flock of geese seem to be without their leader. They just circle and circle. I don't seem to be able to get in any formation and their cry sounds so distressed. Moving further to the east and south. They, they got out of, I could follow them quite a ways with this, with the telescopic lens, but they got quite a bit out of eyesight, natural eyesight. 
They're moving to the east. Oh, French drain. Actually, looks almost like a war zone here. All these trenches dug in our backyard. There's a faithful apricot tree. Don't know whether it'll survive the onslaught to its roots or not. And a pretty little red maple. Been so gorgeous this year. Roots are exposed all the way. I'm afraid we may lose it. There's a big locust tree here. Roots are chewed into considerably. I'm going to be extending the steps. This level of the deck will fill in the space here. And the next level, 10 foot section, go all along there. And then the third level, beyond that. Quite a different look from when we had the old playhouse on the hill that the kids had so much fun with. Today is May 17th, 2000. Uh, we need to update the record of our remodeling and re-landscaping that's required in, in the process of getting these new parts built. We uh, have completely wrecked the backyard. <laughs> but. Uh, I think there have been some uh, records. This is uh, just looking inside the plant room here, which hasn't really been put to good use yet, but we've got a few things growing in there. And the extension on the deck became quite a project. I think there may be some on another film that shows the in-between, but there's the completed deck. We lost the trees in the middle, but we'll try to replace that. We have also taken out the huge, and just a few days ago, the big pine tree that's in our backyard. We're going to be uh, layering the backyard with the rock wall along there. We'll probably lose the peach trees. That's going to make a whole new look and I think we're going to be pleased with it. A fellow by the name of David Blaine is going to be doing the work for us. To look out the front where the big pine tree was also removed uh, several weeks ago. I'm going to just smooth that out and put grass. I'm trying to simplify the work in the yard work. We have had some beautiful roses already this spring. And we're starting. There goes the peach trees, I'm afraid. Think of all the hours I spent working on those little trees and trying to care for them and the fruit that they've produced through the years so much. Good fruit. Oh, gone. Goodbye, little 
trees. Big one. Really dig it in there and goes to work. out the old sprinkling pipes. This is where we used to have the lilacs. Oh, they're digging out to put a row of rocks. To... This is where we used to have the lilacs. Oh, they're digging out to put a row of rocks to be a retaining wall to hold the weight off the crumbling wall of the neighbors there. Here's the two peach trees. Turn out. 